So, uh, I think, I mean, let me put this way. You're what I call uh, uh, a Cape Flats cat. You know what I mean? Yeah. A Cape Flats cat. So, if I say that to you, what, what does that mean to you? It's basically like, I'm a Cape Town. I grew up in Cape Town almost all my life. And the Cape Town conditions are always any other person from other culture and other state conditions. That's what, that's what that state means. Mm, mm, mm. No, no, did, did you have a regular uh, Cape Flats? I'm saying, well, where are you from in Cape Flats? I'm from Elsie's River. Mm. That means, um, Elsie's River means, let's say, you can't say it's the heart of the Cape Flats. Because the Cape Flats is not just like one city, like one place. The Cape Flats mm. is basically Elsie's River, and Bobby Devo, Mango, all those places that have flats, makes up the Cape Flats. So mm. Basically, yeah, I'm from a section of the Cape Flats. Yeah. But you know, I have to say, I have to, this is this is I, it's not me. This is what's said, you know. Mm. They're rough there, you know. Uh, if, if, if you say K Flats, a lot of people, a lot of people, automatically say, "Hold more prison." What's the what's the what's what's the conditions of the place? But they, to be honest, most of the time it's true. Most of the time it's true because this kind of it's very rough. Growing up, it's either you join them or try to get them. That's a that's more of a, of a mindset of people growing up. Especially with boys, so boys are still playing because you see all these things, you see other adults and go what they do in the community, you try to be like they, or they try to be better. It's, it's like that. Well, you know, I grew up in the South Bronx, but there's something that happens in, 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 in the in American jails as well. If they have somebody, they'll have gangs. But there, there, there's always somebody that say that you can't join the gang. They want that person to make it out. Is that is that a phenomenon too? Okay, yes, you do, you do get that in most cases also, but not all the time. Nowadays, they just want to recruit, they want to recruit. So they do get into work for that's how it goes now. So that's why you know, we got the old people in and shied away from those schools. Because I used to, I used to be in those schools, shied away because I thought that this is to give me advice on uh, my family, so you know, that's not worth it. And I actually realized that 16, 17, it's not worth it. Yeah, they say the life of a criminal is not as long as people think, you know? That is long, yes. <laughs> well, what, um, so you, uh, how did you get out? I mean, how, was it a mental thing? I know you said people give you advice, but ultimately it's always going to be the person. I mean, yes. what, what, what do you think, what's the drive that made you different? Um, school, because I think at that time, the friends I had, all of them dropped out of school. So, because I knew it's either going to be, I was, I, I was the only one in school. Mm. So, and I still started feeling, I wanted to go to school, get my friends, and that's going fine, but I was going to be able to school and all of them. But for me, it wasn't that place, so I had a choice. If I do that, I was going to be able to go to school, because I'm a family, because I don't know that. I knew you, because my father didn't finish school. I school, but, so I just kind of like regularly mm -hmm. try and stay on the right path from school and keep a stable the way it got me today. Well, now you, I guess you did the regular school, um, uh, childhood things, some like sports. Sports, yeah. I used to play soccer, I was in athletics, and I used to dance, I was in high school champ. So but you was a good, great dancer, no? Yes, I was a great dancer. You, you was a great soccer player, no? Yes, I was. Oh, you know what that means. You could travel the world and just, just they have a little pickup game, they'll let you ride on in. You know, and you pick up a little musical instrument, you can travel around, be, you know, whatever. I'm not giving you any advice, I'm just saying, you got some skills to move around the planet, you know, like that. Okay, so so so, so now you're going, you're all going to university. Yes, I'm going to university, I'm sick in the What are you studying? Studying human movement science, but around the world, so it's exercise science. Oh, oh, so you stay, <laughs> it's the same thing, okay, okay, it's okay. That sounds like it's going to be a job possibility. Especially yeah, physical education, or sports psychology, so things like that. I have, I have multiple options to choose from. Mm -hmm. I just want to get comfortable in which one is for me. Mm -hmm. you know, I, get, I just want to be brief, but mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. I don't just want to choose this or that for the money or this or that for this and then to be sure. 
Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, just, I'm not going to keep it long. This is his last thing. When he said, I'm not going to choose that for the money. I'm not, I want to get... What is, just break that down for me. What does that, that mean? Because it sounds good. <laughs> well. Okay, it looks like, oh, I pay you jobs. I'm going to do this, can you do that? I'm going to do that. Something can you do that? I'm going to do that first. I'm going to do business management, but then I'm making up two uh, percent. Two, three percent, and then I do it so I have to set up the lesson. Mm -hmm. So now I still have to decide that I'm going to do it. Mm -hmm. In this year that I've had this course now, I've been on the internet, but I haven't made up my mind about what I'm going to do. So I still have to, I still have to make a decision. Okay, so, this, so, so you're focused there, but uh, as usual, you know, you have to be a well, well, people should be well rounded. What, what else rounds you? How do you round this? I mean, how do you? Not just get rutted into something, you know? Okay, um, there's, there's many things that I, that, that, that I can do as, as I do. So, call time, not call time, but like side, call it side houses, like side jobs mm -hmm. and stuff. Like that. So that I have my, 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 my job in the new career field, and then I have a whole lot of other things that I'm also doing on the side. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's my plan. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Well, then I sit down on that. Yeah. Dale, tell, tell us who you are. <laughs> okay, basically I'm an introvert and an extrovert. So oh. that introvert and an extrovert. I, like you said, multiple personalities are changing in the world. Me, myself, I surprise myself. Mm. I would say I'm, I'm well, well around when it comes to talented things. I can do a lot of things. I can, I can play sports. I can do what most people can't do at my age now. Mm. So, I would say. I've never really described myself as the first time, so yeah, I'm just leave it at that point. Uh, I'm not going to ask you for no Instagram pages or no YouTube pages. You know, like, do you do all that stuff? Are you on social media? I, am, I used to be on social media. It doesn't really, doesn't really, what can I say? It's not a thing for me anymore. I'm not going to post it like social media. Yeah, I love on YouTube. Mm. Posting what I do as in terms of dancing, something, recycling. Yeah, I'll post that and I'll watch other people like, no, oh, Instagram post the pictures and mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, have to, you have to be, you have to be consistent with it. Mm -hmm. I don't see myself doing that all the time. Okay, you sound like a, as they say, I hate to do this, I hate to be like an old guy. You sound like a mature young man. You know? <laughs> okay, that's, this is going to be my last question. So, how you... Of oh, people your age, your age range, your 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 back or whatever, where in a where are you in that? I mean, uh, are a lot of people like you, or you say you're so different. What? A lot of people like me. I used to see my, my my parents back in the neighborhood that I'm in. Parents were famous back then. But both of them grew up there, so everybody knows their stories. Everybody knows what they did, what they did, and stuff like that. So. They already had, uh, like, people expected me to turn out a certain way. There was, there was expectations on me, and then I just stayed on the right path. I finished primary school, finished high school, I started university now, so it's like people are surprised of where I turned out. Even many people, they come to me today, they tell me stories, and I'm like, oh, I don't know, like that. And I just look at them and tell me they're actually happy with the way I turned out. So I don't know, I would say most people in my place are actually like me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you for this time. <laughs>